It's time for Insundational with Jalen YC. Yo, what's up? Your boy Jalen YC back at it with another Insundational episode. This is season two, episode 23 of Insundational. Last um, episode, we talked about uh, men's mental health month. Um, basically, if you're a man and you're struggling um, in the world, really, um, just know that you are loved, you are appreciated, and even though it doesn't really look like it is, well, just, if you really think deep, just think about the people that care about you, think about the people that would uh, rock with you, you know what I'm saying? And either, whether if it's like a lot of people or just a, a small circle, you know, just rely on those people, you know what I mean? Um, just know that you're useful, all right? Um... Today episode, we're going to talk about how to ignore hatred. You know what I'm saying? There's a lot of um, people who like to spread hate. Uh, basically, just 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 be better than hate. Like, like this is um this is basically me telling you how to overcome hatred. Like how to be better than people who hate. That type of shit, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I, th I might think of a title about that when I edit it, but... Um, yeah, man. So, yes. In life, when you're living, bro, sometimes for no reason, people will just hate you. Why? I don't know. I don't know why people hate. I, well, maybe they, they can either be jealous or they could just be... Um, they could just be mad and they... For some reason, they want to take it out on you. You know what I mean? Even though you didn't do nothing, people would still do some fuck shit, try to fuck you over by spreading hatred to your and just put that shit to your brain. And um, and they just it's like they just want to make you feel like shit so they can feel better about it. You know what I mean? There's a lot of people like that. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I've I ran into a, a lot of people like that all my life, whether if it's YouTube or in real life. You know what I mean? But um, I know none of you are probably asking this question. How do you respond to hatred? The correct way to, to respond to hatred. Now, normally a lot of people, when, when people like say some negative things about them, they'd be, um, usually they'd be like, hey, fuck you too, bitch. Some shit like that. Like, they try to insult them back just to make them feel better. But honestly, like, that's like starting a war. And in war, nobody really wins because both sides lose shit. Both sides lose people. Both sides in an argument, they lose their, they lose their sanity when they're arguing, when both sides are arguing. So I try not to argue anymore with people because I see that as pointless, you know what I mean? I mean, yeah, I know pe I know you're trying to get your point across and everything, but you can't really convince the other person. Like, if you, usually in an argument, you can't really convince the other person to agree with you, you know what I mean? So the best thing to do is just to ignore it, you know what I'm saying? If, even if it's the most insulting thing in the world, just don't be mad. Like, you can could, you could say something, but don't, like, be too... Don't insult them a little too bad just because um, because you would want to see as the better person. You know what I'm saying? And they think because they're loud means that they're right. No. It's the action. The act, their actions it will expose them. The actions will prove to you who is right and who is wrong. You know what I mean? Um, and yes, I know... I know a lot of people are full of shit and you would want to, my choice of thoughts is just to yell at them, beat them up. But the better thing to do is to not cause a scene, not start any drama, just walk away from it and be the better person, bro. Be the better person. All right. If someone is telling you some hateful, hateful things, bro, just don't clap back bro because it's gonna it's gonna it's just gonna take it's just gonna waste your time really 
like especially in the internet if someone is saying some shit to you on, on the internet and you try to say some negative back then you're just gonna be arguing against someone you don't even fucking know and what's the point of that you're just wasting time you got other shit to do you know what i mean but um yeah man basically just if you see something that you don't like or if someone says that you don't like just breathe and just don't like j just say that um I, I don't i don't have time for this ignorant shit i'm dealing with right now i got other shit to do say some shit like that you know what i mean maybe not cuss because that's what starts to get them you know a little more riled up but just say listen i got other i got other stuff to do or, or something like that or or if it's just or if you don't have anything to do just say just just humbly say like like i just don't want to argue like like i'm trying to figure some things out when it well i mean um depending on what type of argument it is something like that like basically say something that is not insulting say something that at least tries to humble them you know what i mean but okay let's say this say something humbling but try not to insult them too hard or even better don't insult them at all you know what i mean because if you're trying to like if someone yells at you and you yell back that's bad right that that just creates more drama but if someone yells at you and you do nothing not not really do nothing but you just walk away from it or just just say that my bad whatever you're just a better person bro you're a better person. You want you want the argument because you're not trying to be you're not trying to be um you're not trying to be in a, in a delusional conversation, a delusional loud conversation. That's basically what an argument is. An argument is a delusional loud conversation. You know what I mean? And it's better not to it's better not to be in one. You know what I mean? Because like at the end of the day, that's how friendships. Um, stop. That's how breakups start to happen. That's how. Um, that's how a lot of bad shit be happening, bro. So, yeah, man. That's basically how you respond to hatred, man. Um, just be the better person. The next time you get to the argument, do not yell back. Be the better person. All right. Just do what's best for you. Like if you wanna. If you have a valid point, at least try not to scream it. You know what I mean? Don't don't try to scream your point. Because that just makes that just makes you like I don't know, the other person would think that you're wrong most of the time. If you if you say it normally, then maybe the other person might think with their brain and not with their mouth. You know what I mean? But yeah, that's basically it for today's episode of Insundational. Hope you guys learned from this. Even though I'm not the smartest person in the world, but hey, I try. But um, yeah, man, more videos to come, of course. And uh, yeah, guys, have a good Sunday. Thanks for watching the video. Don't forget to subscribe and like if you want to. I'm not going to force you to do it, but yeah.